Welcome everybody to the Chaffinch Road Auction House and uh, first of all I'll just introduce you to the proprietor Here she is. Can you give us a wave please, Mari? Just say hello. <laughs> Fine. Right, now um, we're going to start the auction with um, a very rare photograph. Um, here we are. It's of a man taking the tea round. Um, ingenious how they used to do it in those days. It's like you see in Africa women bouncing stuff on their head. This chap could bounce loads and loads of tea. What? It's not. Oh. Ah. Oh, terribly sorry. Uh, I've just been informed by our authority that um, is, these, these are actually clay and they're going into a kiln. And he tells me that, um, oh, by the way, this is a job lot. Um, forgive me not for mentioning it. It comes with an Iron Age piece of iron, this one here, and uh, a non Iron Age um, knife. Right, could we look at the back, please? Oops. There we go. It's signed by Mr. Tiny Products, uh, a famous um, mug maker. And yeah, Jeff Dodd. Uh, maybe it was Jeff Dodd. Uh, yeah, sorry, this is Jeff Dodd. Tiny Products was um, uh, his teacher. Yes, Jeff Dodd, about to load his aristocrat kiln. Oh, well. I think that, um, that does put the price up a bit as it's an aristocrat. Um, we'll just stick that back on there. Right, we move on to the next lot. Ah, yes. Now, you don't see this anymore. anymore. Very rare, very rare to come to auction. Um, it's polystyrene packing. Yes, you probably don't know what polystyrene is. Um, let's just have a closer look. I'll get rid of that. Look at that genuine still solid look I can well I did break it but I could hardly break it um, this was used for packing uh, yes it's when people put things in parcels yeah um, now uh, oh, one of our prize lots um, a three-in-one bird food by the very famous Bill Oddie look he signed it just there beautiful now you can get these unsigned but the signed ones are very rare um, and there he is uh, you can recognize him I hope good 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 now we'll just move on to the next item ah this is a job lot um, a cup and saucer and saucers without cups um, now of course we we, we tried to match the, uh, well, what? Oh, sorry, the cups were broken. <sighs> Damn, you idiot, why did you bloody break them? Oh my God, you just can't get this stuff anyway. Anyway, I'm assured that um, the Queen used these. And to prove it, there we go. By appointment to, Is that the king or the queen? It'd be very rare if it's the king. No, it's it's his the queen. So it's it's um I think it dates from 1952. So it was in that period between king and queen, but she just went into the queen period. Very rare. Um, and it's got the original dirt from the palace because um, the queen never did any washing up. No, of course she didn't. She's the queen. Ah, next lot. Ah, right. Now, these belong to Dick Turpin. Yep, yep, I know they look modern, but in fact, um, Dick Turpin was a bit of a revolutionary and um, he invented lots of stuff before they were needed. Um, now, when he was caught, um, he had to use these table legs because um, he didn't have a leg to stand on. And this is Let's get an accurate picture there. This is the, the original brush, Dick Turpin's brush, after his brush with the law. Right, now, what else have we got? Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> now, this is a genuine antique. 
Not that the others aren't, uh, but this is off an NSU Quickly. Uh, it's funny it was called the Quickly because it wasn't all that quick. Uh, I had had I had one uh, for a while um, until I took the baffles out and the police chased me and um, I had to sell it because the fine was so much. Now, what have we got here? Ah, oh, ha, 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 ha. Yes. This is David Bowie's. Oh, where are we got? Where are I? Can't get the. Ah, here we are. This is David Bowie's first fan. Yep. Um, well, you know, pop, art, uh, pop stars, you know, you see them with thousands of fans, but they all have to start somewhere. And he's tied with his first fan. And um, I think this came out of. Um, his dad had an Austin 16, then after that it was a 50s Hillman Minx, and then a 60s Minx. Um, but um, I'm afraid we don't have the provenance on this um, and it isn't signed. So, sold as seen. Right, as we're in the fine art section, um, this is a wonderful uh, piece of early pornography. Yes. And, um, shit. Ah, let's see if we can get a good picture of Who put the sun in my face? Can't see a damn thing. Um, it's Lady Godiva. Apparently. I can't see what I'm doing, I'm afraid. I'm just going to have to go on instinct and hope you can see that. I shouldn't have set this up. I mean, you shouldn't have set this up with the sun in my back. You know I can't film like that. Yes, yes. Okay, right. Now, next, oh, there we are. Yes, she is. Anyway, um, moving on. We're going back to, um, ah, here we are, tools. Uh, here we have this one here. <coughs> These are shears, uh, but they're very special shears. They're shears for a one-handed person. Yeah. And here's a wrench. Uh, and this could be a one-handed person but it can also be used by a two-handed person and it's so heavy you probably would want to use two hands now moving on <laughs> oh dear oh dear oh dear you do not see these these very rarely come up dulux solid emulsion and just to prove it is solid oh bloody hell oh oh Oh, oh, my hand. Ooh. Um, yeah, now the final uh, final piece on the auction uh, before we take the break is, yes, dish of the day. This is very old, very, very old. In fact, it came from the Old of I Gorge. Yep, the Old of I Gorge. They it was found alongside Lucy. Uh, the missing link and um, it was an amazing find because up until then they thought that she was closer to being a monkey than a human <laughs> and um, and also uh, not only had ancient humans learnt how to forge steel and press uh, plates um, but we also could see, we got an insight into their diet. And um, it was thought they lived on berries and um, uh, fruit uh, foraging. But in fact, the bulk of their diet was dust. Yes, yeah, I know it's hard to believe, isn't it? And look, here it is, fossilized dust. <laughs> oh dear. <clears throat> Um, right, we're going to take a break now before um, for a cup of tea. Um, we'll be back with you soon. Bye for now.